Welcome to Connect Learn. I'm Steve, and we're getting started with Python tools for Visual Studio. If you missed our previous video on getting everything installed and set up, you can find a link for that down below. But now, let's actually get some code into Visual Studio. If you've used Python before, then you'll be aware that it lays out projects by how files are set out on disk. And this is fine for simple projects, but as you start adding more files, and maybe including web pages and JavaScript, and eventually automatically generated files, the file system starts to be a, a bit unwieldy. So Visual Studio uses projects to manage these files. And projects achieve three things. The first is they identify the critical files. These are your plain source code and not anything automatically generated. You could think of this as the files you check into source control or the files that you'd give to another developer so they can work on the same project. Visual Studio projects also can embed build information. So maybe some files, every time you change them, you need to run a rebuild step. And that can be encoded in a Visual Studio project. And finally, it can be used to componentize your project. So maybe your web application is made up of two separate components that will be deployed to separate servers. Or maybe part of your project is in another language, like C++ or Node.js. Visual Studio can have multiple projects open at once. And so by having separate projects for each, you can clearly define the boundaries between your files. Now, let's take a look at the templates that Visual Studio includes for Python applications. If you've already got Python code you'd like to work on, the From Existing Code Wizard will help you create a project that includes all of your files. We include a number of web projects for some popular frameworks. And if you install our sample packs, there's even more. And there are options to make these work with other frameworks. Finally, a Python application is a clean, empty project. There's one module to get you started and the freedom to add whatever else you need. In Visual Studio, your open projects are shown in the Solution Explorer window, including all files, search paths, and Python environments that you may be using. To add new items, you can right-click your project or a folder, select Add, New Item. You can choose any item from here, customize the name, and it's added to your project. You can also drag and drop into Solution Explorer from Windows, or if you've copied files into your project directory manually, you can manage them by selecting the project, enabling show all files, and then exclude or include files from your project. Now we're all set up and ready to start coding. If you're keen to go deeper, you can check out our deep dive videos that are linked down below. Otherwise, join me next time on Connect Learn.